Welcome to day 18 of my December daily album. And here is the basic layout and the cards and pictures that I will be using for this week. And if you haven't noticed already, this is a Star Wars themed layout or the day that Star Wars came out. And to start off, I'm just going to label that, mount that peace, love, and joy little cutout that came from the six by six by six eight paper pad and I'm just layering it on that black and white and I didn't have any black thickers for today so I'm just going to color these gray ones and I'm just using a permanent sharpie marker and I'm just coloring that in and I'm also making sure to color the sides of it so that color doesn't peek through the sides and these are the foam type thickers and they actually take color very well. I've um, colored them before with fingernail polish and that worked out pretty good. And I'm just coloring the side so that color doesn't peek through and I'm gonna give that a second to dry. And that card said, peace, love, and joy. So I'm just gonna cover up the joy so it says, peace, love, and Star Wars and that little piece of um or the back of this sticker page i used all the letters that i wanted to use this week and i tried to line them up to make this go a little quicker because i already knew what alphas that i would be using this week and i go to put that um 18 in the corner and it doesn't fit so i have to switch to the other corner and i don't know i i'm used to using the right hand corner to put my numbers so I guess I have to switch it up for today and that completes this card all right and I know this is a horrible picture but this is the picture we took right before we went to the movies and I have bought a remote for my camera for the holidays and I could not get it to work so that picture is just taken with the phone and we're all all three of us are trying to get in the phone and as you can see it didn't work my son's head is chopped off but I still use the picture and the remote wouldn't work and we were about to be late for the movies so I said you know what this will just have to do <laughs> and I'm gonna add some journaling just saying that the um we're trying to take a selfie and I wanted to add that reindeer but it was just too too big to go on there so I just added the little snowflakes that were on that little sticker and those stickers came from a Hobby Lobby sticker sheet and these enamel dots I bought those to use for Halloween and I never did I never did that layout so they work perfectly for this layout and I was just writing my journaling trying to take a picture before going to the movies was an epic fail <laughs> And the um, a lot of this black paper that I will be using today, I didn't really have any. I don't have much black in my stash. And my pen pal, she sent me, she sent me a package a while back, and it had a black and gold theme. So most of, most of this black paper came from there, because I don't know. I really don't have much much black paper. So I, I guess this scheme is, I don't know, kind of out of my comfort zone. And this is just a picture of my son with his little lightsaber playing right before we left also. And we all had on our little, our little Star Wars shirts. And they were, they were so excited. I think this was the highlight of their holiday season. And on here, I am just spelling out, I am your father with these little black alphas. And for some reason, these alphas are hard to line up. I mean, I've used these type of alphas before, and I've even used smaller ones. But these were just harder to line up. I don't know. So I kind of saved, saved you from watching me stick every little letter on because I had to pull it up a few times. And I'm just going to complete well, maybe I didn't add any enamel dots to that card. And this card is pretty simple. And you see I just ran out of um, glue tape. So I just had to replace that a second. But this card 
it's pretty simple I'm just gonna mount this picture on there and that's a picture of Deadpool it was a little display at the movies so me and my son went to the picture with him he was pretty excited about that even though he will never see that Deadpool cartoon that are the movie because it's a rated R movie and that picture is taken in the movies that's why it has that weird brightness you know when you take a picture in the dark with the flash it just comes out weird but I wanted to include the picture anyway and that's just just us in the movies with our snacks all right and this Star Wars or this uh, Stormtrooper head came with a pair of socks that I bought and my son saw it on my desk and the only way to get it from him was to let him help me put it on here so he is being my little helper for this layout and yeah I had to get the uh, glue tape out of his hand <laughs> and I'm just gonna write at the movies on this on this tag and I mean I'm just using it because it had the black and white in it but I'm gonna cut the rest of the tag off you'll see in a second because I didn't have any any tags with black on them so I'm just gonna cut that and just use the bottom of it and I fiddle around with a spot to put that because I couldn't decide where to where to put it because I don't know this car it just seemed like something was missing so you'll see me move it around a few times I think I finally I finally put it there and I add these enamel dots only to pull them up I'm about to pull them up in a few seconds because I don't know this car just needed something else so I tried not to do this for the December daily album go digging through my stash but I didn't have much black items pulled out so I had to dig for today and I think I end I found a few things that didn't work that today didn't work so I ended up finding this little memories sticker and I pull those enamel dots up so I can stick it right there and I, I just think that balances out this card and I'm putting the enamel dots back on and I'm out of frame for a second but I think I'll come back and I'm just gonna outline this stormtrooper head just to help it blend in with the with the layout and I'm trying to find trying to add something else but I, I think I just left it alone because it was nothing else to add to that card and I don't know, I haven't been, I've been uh, pretty much pretty decisive with my December daily up until this day, I guess, because I didn't, I didn't have stuff already laid out and the black and white color scheme is a little out of my comfort zone. And this picture is just my husband with his, that's uh, with his Darth Vader sweater. And I'm just going to write the date on here. And I'm going to do one of those uh, flip up cards. That's why I have, because I had two pictures and I wanted to include both of them. So I'm trying to f figure out how to uh, do the flip up. But I think I'm just going to have one picture on top. And I'm going to do the journaling on the back of the top picture. So this one will be on the bottom. I'm just going to layer it on that on this striped card stock and once I trim this one down I do the journaling on the back of this card and I just put that little uh, sticker it says hello gorgeous I think it's funny because it was ugly Christmas sweater day at my husband's job all right, and on the back, I added this little tag with the snowman, and I hadn't used this tag yet. So I thought this would be the perfect little spot to stick him. And I was adding my journaling that it was ugly Christmas sweater day at work. And my husband had originally bought another sweater. Well, I, I picked the other sweater. 
And he said it was just too ugly. And I told him, you know, that's the point of it. But he, he was like, well, I can't wear that. <laughs> so he found this Dark Vader sweater at the last minute. And he added some little silver. I don't know what that stuff is called. That stuff you put on the tree. I don't know if it's tinsel or garland. Whatever it is, he stuck it on the sweater. But he was excited about that Dark Vader sweater at the, that he found at the last minute. And I just add those little enamel dots and that card is done. And I thought I would flip it up top ways, but I ended up doing it sideways because I couldn't find my little flip up cards. And on here, I'm just writing the word Christmas. And it sped up, but I was writing very slowly because I didn't want to have to write it a second time because I think I only had one of these cards left and that seems to be the trick for me for my hand lettering it comes out right when I only have one card left All right, I already had my words picked out that I want to use. So this spelled out sweater. And when I was trying to put it down, the R tore in half. And I went to look on my sticker sheet. That was the last R. So I'm just trying, I tried to find another one. I didn't have any. So I'm trying to save this one. And I try and stick it on as straight as possible. Then I take a black Sharpie and just color over the parts where it was torn and I don't know I think it kind of works with the whole ugly sweater theme like the card isn't perfect the card is you know <laughs> it's kind of ugly and I had picked out those black words and those are those I think the um, simple stories letters I haven't used those in a while but they didn't look right so I pulled those up and I'm doing using the silver ones and I've had these silver alphas for a long time. I think I bought them either last Christmas or the year before. And I don't they don't have much stick left to them. So I have to um add some more glue to each one. And I put these on my title page for my December daily album. And most of them are now just sitting in the bottom of the page protector. So I have to go back and glue those. And I'm just outlining these letters in black just to help them stand out because they weren't standing out on that pattern and stay tuned I'll have pictures at the end because I added I think I added a sticker to this layout this concludes day 18 of my, in my December daily album I hope you are enjoying this December daily series I will have pictures at the end and I will also be uploading pictures of each layout to my blog.